Hello guys, welcome back to Coding Cafe. So from this tutorial onward, we are going to uh, start work on the friends functionality. That is, we will uh, be basically allow a user to send friend request to his friend or you can say to other person from his school, college, university or I mean to any person around the world. So let's do it. So go to the Android Studio and first of all we will be needing to create another activity. So click here, click new, activity, empty activity and the name of our this activity will be person profile activity, person profile activity, click finish. So let's let it finish the loading i mean the gradle or running okay uh, person profile activity is launched successfully now what we're gonna do first go to the xml file for this activity which is activity person profile dot xml and now all we need is to go to text and let's change this constant layout to relative layout and now the next thing is uh, we will be needing to uh, display the profile activity and the information about the user but this time uh, I mean when a user let me complete it you will understand it okay basically here we will uh, we are going to create an activity and a layout basically where we will uh, display the two buttons that is the send friend request and cancel friend request or you can set a decline friend request and I mean the person when a user search for his friend uh, as you know that we have add the searching functionality which allow a user to search for people so once he found his friend from uh, I mean a, a person from his school college or university then he, he will be able to send a friend request to that person okay so yeah uh, and uh, as I told you we will be uh, once we complete this then we will be adding the um, messaging functionality after that okay so now for the time saving as you know that we have create another activity where, which where we wrote uh, some code so we will go to the here come here and uh, we can we have this activity click post.xml file I mean this one okay not this one sorry activity profile activity okay which is profile okay activity profile dot xml come here and we need this information i mean these fields also on our activity person profile as you know that this activity is for the specific person who is online okay and now uh, we need this on our this activity so let's click on this text and now what we gonna do here that is come here and from here okay we have the scroll view so copy this okay select all these up to the end above the scroll view okay so we have to uh, copy this the code inside the scroll we copy that and let me tell you do the same which i am doing here okay so control c copy it from here let's uh, close this and now let's go to the text and here I will paste that so you can see that it uh, comes here but now let's give it some background then we, uh, we will do some changes here okay and it is color profile this color okay and this is the scroll view and now at the end we will add two buttons the send friend request and cancel friend request or you can say uh, the decline friend request okay now the next thing is uh, to change the IDs okay so do this task carefully and I will uh, recommend you to do the same which I am doing here okay change the IDs from here so the ID for the image will be let's remove this and the ID for this image will be uh, act person underscore profile okay person profile pick okay as the name of our this uh, activity is person profile activity so we have to give it some unique and best names which we remember okay so person 
profile pic and then after that we have a text view which is for the for the profile name so we can uh, give it a name as person full name and now uh, we have to uh, copy the id of the image okay copy this and change it here which is android layout below so it will move below this okay you can see that you have to arrange this also and now the next one is uh, the username you can see that so let's give it id and the id for this will be person username and copy the id of the full name which is this one and uh, paste it here so that it can move below the username so you can see that remove this one and paste that here okay you can see that and after this we have the profile status so remove this and let's give it person profile status and copy the person username id and you can see that uh, android layout below so paste that here so make sure to do it very carefully okay at the same way which i am doing in front of you guys and now the next one is the country so we can say person country and uh, copy the id of person profile status and we can paste it here okay so that it can move below and now the next one is the date of birth so we will we will call it person dob and copy the id of the country person country and paste it here instead of my country you can see that okay the changes is here and we can call it as person gender copy the id of person dob and let's paste it instead of uh, my dob you can see that now the next one is the relationship status so we can call it as a person relationship status and copy this person gender id and paste it instead of my gender you can see that okay it comes here and now uh, we are done with that okay so we have successfully uh, give it the unique ids if you do not change it correctly then our app will crash okay so make sure to do the same changes which i done here okay you have to be careful uh, while giving ids to these fields so everything is okay now and the next thing is to add two buttons so let's do that so here we can create the first button and this button will be the width should be 230 dp and the height should be wrap content and let's give it some designing and move it down below so first let's give it some id so the id for this button will be android id id will be person underscore send friend request underscore button this is the id for our this button okay and now let's move it down below so what we gonna do here we can say layout below layout below and the id and the id will be we need to move it below this relationship status so we will pass that id here now you can see that it is moved down below and now let's give it some margin from the top so the margin from the top should be 45 dp you can see that and now the next thing is to give it some color so the color will be android background and the color will be color primary dark which is this one let's check it you can see that okay and let's assign some text to this so the text will be uh, send 
friend request and the text color will be text color will be android colon color and it should be background light so let's check it you can see that and the text size will be 16 sp so it looks beautiful and let's move it to the center so for that we can write here as a layout layout center horizontal layout center horizontal to true and you can see that it moves to the center so this is the send friend request button and now we need another button so let me tell you that is uh, let me explain it uh, i mean before we move to the coding so uh, let me tell you that this button will perform uh, two functionalities or uh, yes one is that is when a user click on the send friend request button then a request will be sent to that person and then this we will change by using the coding by using coding we will uh, change this button to cancel friend request okay i mean the request is sent to a person and now the user is able to cancel that friend request again if he or she wants and let's say i am uh, you are the person who received friend request from me okay so there you will see only one button and that will be that is you have the option that is to accept that friend request and to cancel that friend request okay i hope you are understanding this when i am saying these things okay so we need another button for the receiver of there i mean when the the request the request receiver so if you do not understand it then don't worry when we uh, will write code for these buttons and when we for when we will be uh, adding these functionalities and you will be writing code for that then you will understand everything when we run the app and when we complete this okay i will explain each and every step okay so you don't have to be worry about that for now just follow the steps which i am doing okay so we will copy this button and let's create another button we will change that button okay so the id for the second button will be uh, person let's call it as decline underscore frin friend request so this is the person decline friend request and the text for this button or i mean the name for this button will be decline friend request this is our second button and let's check it uh, we, you can see that the board buttons appear same because the IDs are same so let's copy the ID of the first button and let's move it down below I mean the decline friend request to so pass that ID here okay so below the below this button the second button will appear you can see that okay and the margin from the top will be 5dp so now you can see that it looks uh, amazing so in this way we have successfully designed our layout and the next thing is to give some background to uh, this okay so layout from the top 10 is good okay or i think 8 will be good it totally depends on you where you want this button okay you can see that it looks beautiful now and now the next thing is uh, to give background to this second button so the background for this will be color primary okay which is this one so you can see that the design looks beautiful okay so this is the these are our two buttons the send friend request and the decline friend request so i think this is enough for this video tutorial and in the next video tutorial we will retrieve these i mean we will first initialize these fields on our pers pro person profile activity and then we will uh, retrieve these this data 
I mean uh, from the database for the specific user on which a online user is going to search okay and I mean let's say I'm a user so I will search for someone and I will send for request to that person so we will retrieve and we will do all uh, we will uh, do all these things in the next video tutorial so in this video we just designed the layout for our this activity and we designed these uh, beautiful buttons for the send friend request and decline friend request so yeah that's it for this video and if anyone is new to our channel then please subscribe our channel thumbs up for this video and let us know about your reviews in the comment section down below take care of yourself and bye for now